guys? Today I got a video on this right here. It's the Aki 3-in-1 cell phone camera lens. You have a super fisheye lens, a macro lens, and a wide angle lens. Aki actually makes some really nice clip-on lenses. I just did a review from another company with a case that came with lenses included for the iPhone 7. This you can use really for any cell phone that this clip will fit over. Doesn't normally fit over big rugged cases like the Autobox Defender or the Unicorn Beetle Pro, stuff like that. You're going to have a more slim style case or no case at all and you can clip these on over your camera lens and then they give you the effect of the wide angle the fish-eyed or the macro. This one does not come with a telephoto zoom, but that is okay. So let's rip this off. Yes, there we go. But Aki makes nice quality products. I use a lot of their cell phone chargers for my car, home chargers, and things like that. So this comes with a little carrying case, like a soft, hard shell with a little Thing right there, zip it up. Nice, nice. So let's see what else we got. We have the 24 month product warranty. And then we have the user manual. So this is, you know, clip the phone with the camera centered directly inside the lens. And then you screw any of the lens to the clip that it comes with. So pretty self explanatory. Let's open this little thing up right here. Let's shut this down real quick. We can place this on there, like so. So you get a little Aki branded microfiber cloth, and this thing's really, really soft, actually. A lot better quality than you see from some of the other stuff. Get a little clip right here, so you can clip this bag to your backpack or whatever, your belt, whatever you want. Here is your clip. Nice hard spring in there, and that's where you connect your lenses to right there. You have a, like a matte black with a shiny gloss black with a silver trim around it. There's your spring inside. Nice. Let's see what else. We got the Aki. Is this labeled right here? Not labeled, but I'm assuming this is, there it is. The 198 degree fisheye lens. If we can get this in zoom right there. It's the 198 degree fisheye lens. Let's slap that on there like so. So this is a metal lens with a plastic thread so you have to be careful that you don't cross thread them. But it actually threads in pretty nice. Get an idea of what that looks like right there. So these are really really top quality. It has some heft to it actually the fisheye lens. Let's throw the cap back on that. Um, I actually work for a construction company and we do stuff for this old house. My boss is a guy that's on this old house. He's the landscape contractor, if you guys know this old house. And the host of this old house has a really nice camera, but he also uses his cell phone and he uses a clip-on Aki wide-angle lens. And that's how I first seen it. And the quality of the photos that he gets is really unbelievable. I was very surprised by it, so I had to pick some up. So this is your wide angle plus your macro lens. If you can zoom in on that, see that? So you separate these two in the middle. So you get your wide angle. And then if you don't want your wide angle, you just want macro. This separates right here. So that is really good. Macro lenses are really, really handy if you're doing you know, flower photography. You wanna get little dew droplets of water and stuff on plants. That is really gonna come in handy for that right there. Because most of the time your cell phone with such a small sensor cannot get that close to stuff without being blurry. You throw the macro lens on there and it really brings in detail on you know, leaves and anything really, really, really close up, even you know, lettering on stuff does a great job. So these lenses seem to be really nice. Right now they're currently unavailable on Amazon. They're out of, um, out of stock, but there's a ton of other ones from Aki. I'll leave some links in the description, but I'm gonna get into some photo samples and probably a couple video samples. Okay guys, before we get into the camera samples, I'm gonna actually show you how they work on the phone. So you take this clip right here and you go over the lens and you wanna center it right on the camera. 
So you're gonna have to turn the phone on to adjust it probably a little bit. So let's turn the phone on. Let's actually turn it on first, slap this on, and then we'll get into the camera. So that I don't think is quite centered. We'll have to play around with it, but you can see that is your fisheye right there. And that might not be quite centered. It's a little bit different on Samsung phones because they have the weird camera. It's like a squared off camera. So let's see if we can slap this on my LG V30 quick. That has more of a characteristic circle lens right there. Be a little easier probably to center that off. This thing has a huge fingerprint on it, so let me wipe that off quick. That's one thing you're gonna have to keep track of is you don't wanna have fingerprints on these when you're turning them on and, and using them. You want them to be as focused as they can be. So there's your fish-eyed lens. That's pretty cool. Definitely gives it a you know different style if you're into that fish-eye look. I'm into this more for the macro and the wide angle, so we'll get into that with the other things, but I just want to show you guys how it looks on your camera. You can leave a case on it, I'll show you with a case. So this is a pretty slim case. So you slap this on like that. And there you go, you get your fish eye. So I just want to show you guys how they go on. They go on fairly easy, the clip goes on super simple, has a little rubber gasket on the inside so you can get that right there. It seats and it stays still. It doesn't slide around because it's rubber. So that's pretty cool. So we'll get into the camera samples right now. So just keep on watching and check those out. This is the wide angle lens, Aki camera lens you'll see in the mirror right there. Clip on, easy. Wide angle, gives you a nice view of everything that's going on. So in conclusion, for the price of these, they're really nice. They come with a nice heart shell cover case for them with a little clip for your backpack, whatever you want to do. They're really easy. You just clip them on over your camera lenses and there's really no issues. For me personally, I don't use much of the fisheye, so the wide angle and the macro lens is really nice. You've seen in the photos, the photo of the macro on the $20 bill was able to get super close. You would never get that close with the smartphone camera. And that was on the Samsung Galaxy S8. I did notice a couple of focusing issues on the LG V30 for some reason, but I think that's more due to the LG V30 already has focusing issues as it's on its own. So this camera lens just, you know, kind of really pointed that weakness out. So with that said, I think it's a, you know, big thumbs up for these or something similar to these they're great moment, makes great lenses. They're really expensive, it's about a hundred bucks per lens, something like that. They have a nice setup going on there. That's really on the high end. This is more on the low end. So you make your decision. I think these are great. They definitely help out your photography, give you that shot, wide angle shot if you need it, and you don't have it with a camera like the Samsung Galaxy S8. I did do a comparison you'll, that you guys seen with the V30, 
the wide angle on this is a lot wider than what you get with this, but it does help. Overall, I like it, and for the price, you can't beat it. I hope you guys like this video. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.